Now, many firms are flocking to Asia to target new wealthy clients, including a host of entertainment businesses targeting the rising middle class in China, India and Singapore. Well, one of them, the nightclub Pangea, has been dubbed the world's most expensive nightclub, with cocktails costing as much as $26,000. I spoke to Michael Alt, the club's founder, and asked him what it is about Singapore that has attracted such lavish spending. We're here for a reason. And the reason is, is because this is where the money is. And so um, in the long run, does that help or hurt us? I mean, ultimately in the long run, it hurts us, of course, because, because competition follows success. And so there's no question in my mind that half of the nightclub owners in Europe and America are gearing up to come to Singapore, um, which will oversaturate the market, which will destroy the, in the nightclub industry. Um, and that's how it goes. Do you feel like you're getting a, a little bit of a backlash from the fact that your club has now come to symbolize all that's excessive and overindulgent about Asia's new wealthy? I think in Singapore politically, um, there has been somewhat of a backlash. I think it's a well-run country and it's very affluent, third wealthiest nation in the world. 27% of the nation or uh, uh, of, of the population are, are millionaires. If you exclude their home and their disposable sort of assets like cars and things like that, that's just their liquid assets. So, um, and yet you have the taxi driver, you know, who complains bitterly about how the fact that they have to work, you know, 18 hour shifts. That's not really my problem. Um, that is an inequity that will have to be dealt with um, or not dealt with by the Singapore government. Michael Olt there from Pangea bringing an end. Uh, this edition of Asia Business Report. Thanks for watching.